All right, guys, here's a little article I found online for you. This is about how to pair a Bluetooth device with your X1 TV box or Flex streaming device. I didn't even know you could do this, but it says uh, basically to pair it, you press the Xfinity button on your remote, then you select the little gear icon. Navigate to device settings, audio, then Bluetooth devices. Select the Bluetooth device. Your X1 TV box or Flex streaming device will search for nearby Bluetooth enabled devices that currently are in pairing mode. Then you select the device that you want to connect from the list displayed, then press OK. You will only be able to connect one Bluetooth device to your X1 box or Flex streaming device at a time. However, that Bluetooth device can still be paired with other equipment. This is if you want to stream the sound coming from the wireless box <clears throat> to your phone or vice versa. You can do it that way. It's pretty awesome, guys. Um, didn't know this feature was available. So allowing you to stream audio to the device from the X1 box or Flex streaming device. So it's pretty cool. So basically you can stream your audio from your cable box to your phone plug in your headphones and listen to your TV sitting on your couch and no one else can hear it. It's a pretty neat feature. I really like that feature. I'm going to actually try this as soon as I get the opportunity to and I'll record another video on me trying this. But <clears throat> here's an article about it. So let's go over it again. Press the Xfinity button and go then select settings and hit the which is the gear icon. Navigate to device settings, audio and Bluetooth devices. Then you select the Bluetooth device. Your X1 TV box or streaming device will search for your Bluetooth enabled devices that are currently in pairing mode. Once, once it connects to it, then you'll select the device that you want to connect from the list displayed and press OK. Once you do that, it should pop up on your phone. It should say yada yada, whoever wants to pair or connect. And then you'll select pair or connect on your phone as well and give it permission to connect. And after that, you should be good to go. So, somebody, you guys, if you guys try this, you decide you want to give it a shot, please comment down below. Let me know how it worked out for you. Let me know if it works. If it doesn't work, if it does work, then uh, <clears throat> I'd like to try it myself and uh, record another video on me trying it and putting it to work. So, keep me informed. Like always, uh, hit that like button. That keeps people coming back to my page. And subscribe and watch my videos, man. I appreciate everything y'all do for me, and you have a great day, guys.